Davis because Elaj Balde is on the bubble right now. It all depends on what Liam Ferris does because Patrick Chan, you know what he will do. Lay claim to a seventh national title. Here's Liam. Fifth last year, you talked about the issues. Groin injury, had to take shots all the time to try to heal. Finally got on the ice in June, and now an Olympic dream awaits. He is the least experienced of the competitors in the final flight. He will skate to the bolt by Shostakovich, and this was made famous by Brian Orser. It was what he skated to in the 1988 Olympics. Look at his speed, filling the ice. Key jump, triple axel. Oh no. Now the key is to go clean and stay ahead of Elaj Balder. to the boards, floats across the ice, big curves, the step sequence, the highest degree of difficulty, level four, gorgeous execution. Choreography by Mark Pillay. I love his skating style. Excellent, excellent technique. He has the knees and the technical ability to appear like he's floating across the ice. Credit to his longtime coach, Lorna Bauer. Another triple here, triple Lutz. Mandatory. Got it. skating. He's loosening up now as the program continues and evolves. Yeah. 
Smart thinking. He had planned a double axle there. When he turned one triple axle to a double, he couldn't repeat it later, and he knew that's excellent training. Throwing a triple toe, double toe at the end. This guy's head was in the game, throughout. Good for him. You know what? He did what he could do. Again, the axles were missed. Does he have enough to beat Elage Balde? Does he have enough to rival Kevin Reynolds? Liam Ferris, will you go to the Winter Olympics? That's going through the head right now. There's Michael Slipchuk, high performance director, former Canadian champion, with a six time Canadian champion, the world champion, Patrick Chan, on his way to the Olympics. Next.